right, hi there, everybody. We are celebrating Craft Brew Week here on Cook's Corner today, and we're joined by two special guests, Nicole Carrier from Throwback Brewery in Northampton. Thanks for being here, and you brought some product as well. Did, yes. And Lori Harnoyes from State Travel and Tourism is going to talk a little bit about this really cool new map to check out. But uh, why don't we start with what are you cooking? We're making a ceviche. Ceviche, and, uh, okay. Ceviche is basically a fish where the acids from juices basically cook the fish. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to take a white fish. I have some haddock here, but it could be any type of fish. It could be shrimp, it could be scallops, and what we're going to do is traditionally limes, right, okay. or lemons. Yep. I have a couple of limes that I juiced, a couple of lemons that I juiced, and I juiced one orange. So we're going to take that and we're going to pour that over the fish. And since it's New Hampshire Craft Beer Week, craft beer week. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we have to take some beer. So this is our double IPA. It's called Don Quixote. It has some really nice citrusy notes to it. So okay. usually I don't measure, but I'm just going to, for the camera here, we'll do, oh, a, little, thank you for we'll do a little measuring here. <laughs> Half a cup of that in there. And then we're going to uh, generously salt and pepper that if you want to yeah, sure. go ahead and do that. The other thing we, we, you want to do is um, about a clove of, of garlic, but I found these really great uh, green garlic at the farmer's market, so we'll just throw that in. Okay, salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. Now, what's going to happen is I'm going to put that in the fridge two hours. Yep. And after that, we'll have the finished result. As you can see here, the acid in the juice basically alters the protein in the fish, so it really basically cooks it. So we have this a science lesson here. Yeah, okay. nice looking fish, really citrusy, and what we're going to do is make a salad. So okay. very simple. We have some red and uh, orange peppers. Throw okay. that in the bowl. We have some red onion. Some onion throw Throwing in there. Okay, there. great. We got some cilantro. Ooh, that's good. Boom, we got some right flavor. Yep. Yeah. Uh, jalapeno. Now, if you don't like hot, I suggest take the seeds out and the ribs out. Yeah. Um, so that's what I did, but as a little kick to it. And then at this time of year, you can get all sorts of nice vegetables from the farmer's market. So I have uh, some tomatoes we're just going to throw right in there. Very cool. If you want, you can throw carrots, you can throw cucumbers. Um, and what we do, very simple, add the just fish in right there. In. Yep. Let's talk a little bit about Craft Brew Week. And you got this really cool new map that you got here. T tell me about this. So this is a new partnership that the New Hampshire Division of Travel and Tourism and uh, Brew and H uh, came together with the craft brewers throughout the state to produce a map uh, so visitors and residents can find the different breweries throughout the state to go and visit and taste the wonderful uh, beer that's brewed here in New Hampshire on rainy and yep. sunny days and year round. It's very popular. It's kind of like you know with the wineries out there, but there's lots of craft brewers out there making some wonderful products. So we got to wrap things up here right. really quick. The web website for more information on that. Sure, it's. Uh, visit nh.gov. You can find uh, the brewery map as well as nhbeer.org. And for Throwback Brewery? And Throwback Brewery is throwbackbrewery.com. All right, Nicole Carrier and Lori Harnoyce, thanks for being here today. That's the final product right there. there Looks you go. yummy. Yep. <laughs> Ceviche salad. Yeah. That does it for us.